Hey everybody! Welcome back! Today we are looking at some entitled teens reacting to their expensive gifts. Need I say more? Mom, I asked for a f calendar. I want one of those big f calendars that I can English. actually see my handwriting in. Every f year something like this happens. I try to get something, I f write it down specifically what I want, and you give me this! I'm leaving right now. Every time this happens. Well, see, here's the thing. The wonderful thing about growing older and, you know, becoming a teenager and becoming an adult is, um, you get old enough to get a job. And with that job, you can use the money to buy yourself whatever you want. Isn't that wonderful? My parents got me the black iPhone 11 with a black iPhone case and I asked for the iPhone 12. Ugh. I don't know, you're not really getting any sympathy from me. <laughs> Some people just need to learn the value of a dollar. Maybe your parents couldn't afford it. You know, there's plenty of kids out there that don't get Christmas gifts at all. Is this not the society we live in? Material things seem to be the most important thing of all, says the girl that loves Chanel. <laughs> but hey, I buy that Chanel with my own money. I told my dad I wanted an iPhone 5S, but he bought me an iPhone 5, so I microwaved it. You did not. No, don't do that. Apologize to your father immediately. Immediately. Finally. By the way, this is your reminder to subscribe for daily videos. We do this every day, every single day. I know. I don't know how I do it, really. No, seriously, subscribe, we'd love to have you. Merry Christmas, I got a new MacBook Pro, skis, and an iPad mini. No iPhone 5 though, my parents suck. Uh, are you kidding me? I got some socks and your parents suck? I agree. Skis, iPad mini, dude, that is like, that's a couple grand worth of gifts, I would say. Santa was pretty darn good to you. Let's learn how to be grateful for everything we have. Gratitude is a wonderful thing. Was I the only person who didn't get an iPad? I mean, I got a car, but that's a different story. Ugh. They should have gotten me a car and an iPad. Parents are just the worst. Simply the worst. I got $50 for Christmas! I was waiting a whole year and I got 50 bucks! And I got a I asked for money for my freaking computer and I got 50 bucks and you got a PS4 which is like $7,000! Not quite, but... Again, there's lots of people that don't get any gifts. I know it's hard to watch your siblings get better gifts than you. But um, you could save up and get your computer. Gotta start somewhere. Work hard, make some money, buy whatever you want. It's what mama always said. She did always say that. Hi mom. My stupid grandma lost my $25 gift card. Hashtag thanks. Mm. Stupid grandma. Stupid grandmas. One day you're gonna miss your grandma. I miss mine a lot. I hate how much my mom has to ruin Christmas by getting everyone stupid gifts. Where is the iPhone I asked for? Oh, God. I don't know. Maybe she couldn't afford it this year, sweetheart. Maybe it just wasn't in the cards this time. She could have given you a lump of coal. I wonder if lumps of coals do get given out to naughty children. Just blame it on Santa. I mean, a present is for good behavior, right? Reward good behavior. I was at a Christmas Eve party where the kids of the family that was hosting got mad they couldn't open any presents yet. So they proceeded to throw their wrapped gifts into the fireplace. They got about five or six gifts into the fire before the dad stepped in. It was one of the most outrageous things I have ever witnessed. I didn't even witness it, and I have to say that is one of the most outrageous things I've ever read. What does that solve? Nothing. Now you don't get any gifts. Is that what you were going for? A little counterproductive if you ask me. POV, you're the rich kid on Christmas. Underwear, really? I said Gucci cologne. I wanted the AirPod Pros iPhone 12 Pro Max, finally you got me something decent. None of this cheap stuff. You're cheaping out on me, mom. Quit being so cheap. This guy won't get a lump of coal, he'll get a whole <coughs> coal mine. Whoa, didn't even get headphones with my iPad. How dare they? How dare you? I think we all need to learn to be a little more grateful. That's all I'm getting from this video. Gratitude goes a long way, you know. The only thing I really wanted for Christmas was a MacBook Pro and I know I won't get one, so whatever, whatever! How do you know you won't get one? How do you know? Is it because, perhaps, you have been naughty? 
I said a white or a pink. And then she's saying that thing doesn't even work, that it keeps falling. Um, well, I know, it does, but I mean, it But look, I put it up and it falls, and then I can't even pull it up anymore. And then, and this doesn't, to and then Diesel's, to his toy doesn't even work. Mama. His toy doesn't work, ba. It doesn't work, his toy doesn't do anything. And it's lost in like the Barbie she got. Yeah. It doesn't. <gasps> yes, I don't like it. I don't like all my toys. I don't like, no. I don't like even my jump to dress. You, know, can, you guys can this keep doing it later, because I don't want it. that mom it is really tough being a parent isn't it it's a thankless job but you know one day when you grow up you're gonna want to get your dad a boat even if you're spoiled <laughs> well my guitar finally came and it sucks not the one I wanted in the first place there are solutions to this we could sell the guitar and get the money from the selling of the guitar and use that money to buy the guitar you want. Okay, here's a question. It is entirely possible to not like a gift that someone gets you. Entirely possible, some people just don't know you well. Sometimes your parents don't know you well enough to know what you like. Is it bad to return a gift if you don't like it and get something that you do like? You let me know. I mean, that's kind of what gift receipts are for. Returning my Kindle Fire and getting an iPhone. This is bull. This is some BS. Maybe your parents just think maybe you should read a little more, you know? It's good for you. Build character. Wanna know why I hate Christmas? Cause my parents never get me. Last year, I literally got nothing. My parents suck. Um, what? I guess you forgot I was on here. For the record, your father and I got you plenty for Christmas last year, this year, and every year. In fact, it breaks our hearts that you would even come on here and lie about something like this for no reason. Do you think pretending to have bad parents makes you seem cool? If so, we will be happy to return all of your presents or perhaps give them to some kids who might actually be grateful to have them instead of pretending that they didn't get anything for Facebook likes. I don't know why you would do something like this after we went out of our way to buy you things that we can barely even afford. I've just asked your father to return everything. I hope you're happy now. I'm guessing not. Is it like a cool thing to be spoiled now? Spoiled and ungrateful? Seems to be something that happens quite a bit on the interwebs. All right, Craig, what do you think? Are you guys serious? A Thunderbolt display? That's crap. You're gonna give me a Thunderbolt display. That's the worst gift ever. Um, it's stupid. No. Stupid! 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 I don't know what a Thunderbolt display even means, but that looked like a very expensive computer, my dear. Even if you don't like a gift, you should always pretend that you love it. Always. As they say, it's the thought that counts. I'm yelling because I only got four gifts under the tree! But what if they're really nice gifts? Less is more. I would prefer four really, really nice gifts than, you know, a bunch of gifts that are just gonna pollute the planet, you know? I swear to God, if there's not a car in my driveway tomorrow morning, I will be crying the whole day. I highly doubt it. It's not a, it, there are better things to cry about. I think you should save your tears for something that matters. They decide they may as well start sorting presents so they can get to opening them as soon as everyone else is ready. Well, the brother who was on camera slowly starts to realize something. I'll sort them, and then by the time she comes down, here it's yours. Here's, did they put all yours on top or something? I don't know, I haven't looked at them yet. Okay, all these years, all those years. <laughs> They're all for the brother holding the camera. Except for one gift from the brother with the camera to the brother on screen. Here's him opening it. This is mine from you. Open it. I thought, okay. Virgin Ultra Thin. Okay. And it's empty. Then Steven has a revelation. The world is out to get him. Nobody cares to purchase him any actual gifts, so it's all gotta go. Christmas is over. No, no, not, yeah. I, don't, I didn't hide put your camera down. Put the camera down. I, I don't know. I'm not gonna put the camera down, Steven. What are you doing with the Christmas tree? Come on. Steven, really stop. You take away my presents, I'll take away your I didn't take away your presents. Steven, trying to accommodate the darkness in his soul, decides <laughs> to light everything up. Burn, baby, stop. burn. Whoa, hey, no. Steven, stop. Tell me where they are. Steven, really, put it I out right it. now. Other ones put it out like right me. now. No, that's what happens. Dude, you can't just burn a tree like... Steven, or should I say the Grinch. 
do better. Pretty awful. Was this a prank? Did he really not get any gifts? I mean, I would be a little bit upset, but not to the point where I would ruin everyone else's Christmas. And my mom went directly against me. She asked me if I wanted a black or white iPad. I said white, of course. Tell me, why is mine black? <laughs> I don't know. I'm not sure. Sorry. Can't help you there. Just get a case. <laughs> your cases. Just buy a case for your iPad. No one's gonna know what color it is. What kind of world do we live in? I wanted an iPad, not a Kindle. We are in a world where people value material objects. This is what it's come to, guys. You know the best gift I ever gave someone? This was when I absolutely couldn't afford anything. And this was a couple of years ago. Couldn't afford anything. So I painted my parents and my brother um, paintings of their favorite musical artists. So I painted my brother a Jimi Hendrix portrait. And then I painted my parents a portrait of Ray Charles. And it was probably one of the best gifts I've ever given anyone. They loved it. It was one of these things that was very personal. I don't know, money isn't everything. I spent time on those. Put my love in, in my heart, my soul. There's a lesson for you. It's not even funny, Dad, you know. <laughs> Here, baby, Hi. look. What's wrong with this phone? <laughs> look at what it. What is that? Mm -hmm. Stop getting that out of what's my wrong with, What's wrong with that phone? What is this? Is this from 2008? <laughs> <laughs> hey, are you freaking serious right now? Baby, it's got a SIM card, a battery, everything. <laughs> it's not even funny, this phone is better than that. What? That's the top of the line LG. Oh God, not an LG. You might as well have got her a Samsung. I wish I had some filthy rich relatives. My presents suck. What makes you think those filthy rich relatives would give you presents? <laughs> Is that how one determines love, gifts? Hey guys, Anne Frank here. So I needed to make a video because something really bad happened. What happened Look at how was many I got in a fight with my mom because this is the phone I wanted. Samsung Galaxy S6 Edge Plus. And this is the phone I got, Samsung Galaxy S6. And as you can see, there's a pretty drastic difference between the two. So um, that made me really angry, and um, I broke one of my MacBooks. The reason I need four MacBooks is because this one's for sending messages, this one's for receiving messages, um, this one is for blocking messages, and then this one right here is for leaving messages on scene. Oh. And so I really, really, really need a new MacBook or money to fix this one. And we can't afford it right now because we're really financially struggling. Yeah, if you guys could donate to me to get a new MacBook or to fix this one, then that would be a lot of help because I really do need all of these MacBooks and it isn't my fault that I broke my laptop. So um, thanks for watching and please donate to me. Anyone want to donate? No one? Alrighty guys, those are some entitled teens reacting to expensive gifts. Remember, the world don't know you. Subscribe! I got something that you